Good, happy Tuesday evening, and I'm Riley King, and welcome to Sports with Riley King, right here on the Riley King Network. Let's begin. First up, Monday, Monday semifinals basketball. Guilford and Newmarket advance. Let's take a listen to that video from WMUR News 9. At Beltates, customers will find everything they need for a building project. The brand names you trust to perform. And with a fleet of over 50 delivery vehicles, we deliver when and where our customers need them. Beltates Building Products. Nine locations throughout New Hampshire and Massachusetts. At Division Four Boys Basketball Semifinals, this is Groveton and Newmarket. They had the early game at Plymouth State College. Groveton's Josh Wheelock feeds Brandon Laundry for two down low. Wheelock had a team-high 12 points. Newmarket's Allen... For Baycam, buries a three at the other end. Then the mules are going to go inside. Owen Tower feeds Logan Willie, who lays it in. He had ten points. The Eagles answer with three on the near court. Julian Kennison knocks it down. Will Chase had 12 points for Newmarket, and they win 40-29. They will play Littleton for the D4 title. Littleton beat Pittsfield tonight, 59-51. Division three semifinals at King State, Hopkinton and top seeded Guilford. Guilford in white, first half, Adrian Saravo buries a three from the wing. Got the fans all fired up. The Hawks look inside to Michael Bear, all alone underneath for a pair there. Guilford goes on to win 53 to 40. They will face Messenic in the Division three championship game. Messenic beats Summersworth in the other semifinal tonight. Okay, and there you go. Team Police hold final practice ahead of Chad Battle of Badges. The 13th annual game is Friday night at SNHU Arena. Let's take a listen to that video from WMUR News 9, Jason King. Beltates, customers will find everything they need for a building project. The brand names you trust to perform. And with a fleet of over 50 delivery vehicles, we deliver when and where our customers need them. Beltates Building Products. Nine locations throughout New Hampshire and Massachusetts. It is game week for the 13th annual Chad Battle of the Badges hockey game. The annual showdown between New Hampshire police and fire. All to raise money for the kids at Chad. The game is Friday night at 7 o'clock at SNHU Arena. Team police held their final practice last night in Exeter, and the guys say they're ready to go. Police always has a ton of talent to choose from at tryouts. They say the team's even younger and faster than previous years. Fire won on the last-second goal last year, and police have not forgot. Yeah, I think we're going to uh, walk into the rink a little bit differently this year. Uh, we're going to have our, our heads uh, screwed on a little tighter this year, I think, and... and um, I'm ready to play because we know what to expect now. Uh, we look good, young. Uh, every year we're getting younger, which is good for some of the uh, vets to give us a little bit of a, uh, a breather there. But uh, new energy on the team. We should be pretty solid. Uh, just for the kids. That's the main reason. Uh, and to have fun, get along, and enjoy the sport of hockey. Friday night, 7 o'clock at SNHU Arena. Okay, and there you go. Boston Red Sox, they had a spring training game today, and let's take a look at the final score from their spring training game today. The Boston Red Sox played St. Louis Cardinals, and the final score, 2-3, to three. and Boston Red Sox won the game. Congratulations, Boston Red Sox. Good job in spring training game. The Boston Bruins, they play tonight at 7 o'clock p.m. at Philadelphia Flyers. And you can watch the game on Nesson, N-S-P-A, and N-B-C-S. And also, the Boston Celtics, they play tonight 
at 7 o'clock p.m. And you can, they'll be playing at Indiana Pacers, and you can watch the game on FSIN and NBSB. And that does it for this Tuesday evening edition of Sports with Riley King. I hope you all enjoyed watching this Tuesday evening edition of Sports with Riley King. Have a great rest of your Tuesday evening. I'll see you back here tomorrow for another edition of Sports with Riley King. Good night and bye, everyone.